comment and subscribe okay you guys today we're back at it with another video I had so much fun doing the video the last time of things that I purchased um, while I was in my funk, a little retail therapy, if you will. I figured since I'm still not completely in my funk, but I'm still having my moments, I might as well go ahead and show you some more of the stuff that I've purchased as of recently um don't mind everything that's sitting over here yet again like i told y'all before i'm always gonna be real with y'all like bro when i decided to do this video i was in the middle of folding my clothes don't mind all this up here this is a whole apple clutter charging section it is what it is but we about to get into this video of some of the things that i've purchased and the first place I'm going to start off with is Dollar Tree. Because I always go there. I'm always getting stuff to clean with, whether it be for at home or at my job. Which is another story for another day. But I'm always getting stuff out of there. And um, we're going to start with that. And the, this time, the reason... Hold on, because I think the reason why I went to the Dollar Tree this time was for something that I saw on TikTok. Um, if I can remember the name of the girl who I saw it from on her video, I will tag her at the bottom um, in the description. Um, but it was a lip gloss, and when I get to it in the bag, I'm going to show you. But I always re-up on... Um, soaps for in the bathroom and this one's our Arm & Hammer Gentle Rose Water that one right there um, I have another one from Yardley London it's a Berry Blossom hand soap this one right here I love their um, regular bar soap <laughs> so when I saw it just got it right here sitting on the shelf but um because i saw it in there as a hand soap i said why not here's another one i know this lighting may not be the best but there's the other one and i have one more from um arm and hammer it's the tropical mango this one I have become a fan of mango, the fruit itself eating, because I found some dehydrated ones from a coworker, and the, just the scent, like, it just smell yummy. Um, I always have palm olive or Dawn, um, mostly for when I'm doing like a deep clean on my locks is when I'll use my Dawn. I always have Dawn in my bathroom, but I also like palm olive. This one is the Oxy Deep Grease Cutting Power. So I figured I'll try this one out. Um, That means I'm missing a Dollar Tree bag. Um, Also, while I was in there, um, Crystal Waters had some body butters and the only scent that i found when i was doing shopping this time was the rose scent but i'm also gonna go and look for other scents because i'm pretty sure normally when they do these little sets in the health and beauty section it's normally like three or four cents but i found this one so i was gonna try this one out I really do feel like I'm missing another dollar. Oh, right here. I was about to say, I knew I had another Dollar Tree bag. Um, and then here is the cleaning products that I always get. The Comet, I swear by this. And then I seen that they have, cause normally I get the little trigger spray bottle, um, but they had the refills. So I had to get it. I bought two of those. Another thing that I just love for my windows, if I'm not using vinegar, it's the Windex. 
and this one is a regular um multi-surface disinfectant cleaner i saw this and i have sorry y'all my nose is aggravating me my allergies are out of control but i have extra spray bottles that i get from the dollar tree so i figured why not get two of these and just use them to fill up and clean with these are the things that I purchased from the Dollar Tree. I have one more bag, but let me get all of this back in here so I can keep this stuff organized because you see how it's sitting up here on my bed. So things liable to be all over the place and still be here when it's about time for me to get ready to go to bed. And then that'll be a whole nother problem for a whole nother show. You feel me? Another thing that every time I go into the Dollar Tree, I look for, um, cause every time the season changes, they get new ones and it's the Ioni lashes. So here's one that I purchased right here. I got a couple of those. That one is the Wispy Hybrid Crisscross Long. And then this one's the Wispy Fluffy Supreme Crisscross Long. So this is a longer one. You know, I love my lashes. I done told y'all this before. Um, here is a Wispy Long Spiky. Right here. I have a couple of different ones because majority of the time I'll buy all of them that's on the thing, which I know y'all can hate me for it if you want to in the comments. But when they get on the shelf, they go. So when I find them and if I got the cash to buy out the whole display, I will. I got me and two sisters. So all three of us wear lashes. So here's another one right here. This is a wispy, fluffy, curly, light crisscross. Um, here's one other one, and it's the wispy volume flare curls. But they're really cute for a dollar, and normally I just mix them up. Here's one more. I'm sorry. This one's a rose peach. Because, I'm sorry, Ayana getting better with these lashes. The ones I have on right now is a triple stack on the Ayana lashes. This one right here is the Wispy Fluffy Cluster Doll Curls. Another one. You feel me? Let me see them. That's all of them as far as the lashes. But then I found a Beauty Intuition Lip Scrub that I just had to get. I don't know what the scent of it is, but I'm assuming it's gonna be, oh wait, Caramel Creme Brulee Frappe. That's the scent for that. And then you guys know from my um, daily skincare routine videos, I love the Aroma Guru and they have the Peppermint Roll-On. I don't know if you can see this, but this one's the Peppermint Roll-On. I bought this one. And that's pretty much everything I got from the Dollar Tree. Um, I'm pretty much in the Dollar Tree like every couple of days. And this is what I wanted to show y'all when I say I go in the Dollar Tree and as the seasons change, I get whatever lashes they have on the shelf. I literally go get one of their baskets and fill it up with lashes. I have three like this. So if my sisters them running low on lashes or they need a pair of lashes when they getting ready to go somewhere or whatnot, you know, I always got the stash. So that's everything from the Dollar Tree. Let me go ahead and move these out of the way. Now the next one we're about to go to is Burlington's. I have been looking for a dryer, a good blow dryer to do blowouts on my daughter's hair. 
I found this one in Burlington's for $20. So we're gonna test this out, see how this works. Right now my daughter's in the kitchen doing homework, but if y'all could see the hair that's on her head, like baby, that's an all day affair. So in between doing mine and hers, a head full of locks and a head full of thick hair, baby, I need something to make this a little bit easier for me. And then every time I go in Berlin Sands, I got to find some type of makeup. Like I love makeup, but if I can get it for cheaper, I'm gonna get it. This one is, I'm not, 100% sure how you pronounce that brand, but it's a nude 35 um, neutral colors on here for $9.99. I'm going to show you what they look like on the inside with a big AF mirror. So don't mind y'all just seeing my phone because that is what I use to record with and tell the camera. You feel me? But come on now. Be for real. Here, let me flip it. New colors, like, don't get me wrong, I like flashy, but when it comes to my eyes, I'll do a nude and then be dramatic with my lips. Here's another one that has a little bit more color in it. It's a Beauty Treats 28 um, eyeshadow, 28 eyeshadow matte and shimmers six face powders and then one professional brush this one was $12.99 I'm assuming because this is a brand that people know a little bit more but this one has a little bit of color in it some shimmer I'm not 100% sure how these colors would go on my face but this blush right here I don't know if it is a blush but this one and this one right here I got to I got to try them on my face. Like anybody who dark skin like me, y'all know like that rust color um right here, and then that nice orange or colors like that. I'm sorry. I don't know if that's how y'all feel, but how I feel, them colors give dark skin life. I'm telling you, like gold, red orange bright ass yellow shit like that that's right up my alley um here's a couple of lip glosses i found from milani a three pack lip glosses 5.99 um one's like a orangish color oh, let's might as well go on here to open it so we can get the real colors I'm assuming these have scents of a fruit on it because on the cap, it's a fruit. Hold on. Your girl might not be able to get them open with these nails. Okay. If y'all hear noise in the background, that is my niece. Okay, we have um, 240, which is very cute. And that looks like that's blueberries on there. So I'm assuming that's going to be the scent. 250 Mon Cherry. And there she goes. My niece right there in the background. And then you have 260 Jess Peachy. Okay. So like I just said, um these milanis let's go ahead and open them to see if they actually do have that scent for the flavor that's listed on here i got these nails on so it's not gonna be as easy oh or well, maybe it was oh this do smell peachy Okay, now this a real gloss gloss because this a little bit thicker, thicker. 
Sorry, y'all. Then the last ones I tried on where I told y'all they was real buttery and smooth. And they do. This one smells good. It smells real peachy. Let me see if I got a towel. It doesn't feel bad though, even though it's a little bit thicker. It does show the color. It doesn't have that sticky like most glosses do. So that's not bad. But it does have pigment because that pigment is showing on this green uh, wash call. Let's try the Berry Cute. This one is purplishy color. Now this smell like blueberries. Oh, come on now, what's that on my face? And I ain't gonna hold y'all. I like this. This very cute. Do y'all see that color though? They put a little bit more on the bottom because it seems like it's showing more on the top than on the bottom. Okay. Milani. Fucks with this. I like this one a lot. And you can smell the scent. Like it's a strong scent. But it's not a bad scent. So it don't really bother you. But I like this color. What y'all think? I like this one a little bit more than the peachy. Because burgundy. <laughs> you can't never go wrong with that. Whether well, it's lipstick, 99J hair color, none of that. Okay, we got one more to try. And this is the Mon Cherry. This one has some glitter in it, looks like, from the container. Now, this got a strong cherry smell. And if, oh, sorry. If y'all hear kids in the background, that's my daughter, niece, and nephew. Okay. I like this one too, now. Yeah, these going in the purse. These most definitely are going in the purse. Now, some other things that I picked up, um, well, was a pair of shoes that I picked up out of Burlington's. Um, a pair that I got for me is actually gonna be the only ones I'm gonna be able to show you. I'm not gonna be able to show you the ones that I got for my daughter because she has them on. But I'm a Puma head. I had to get these, bro. I had to get these. Pumas. Like, and I've been wearing these to the gym. When I tell you, every pair of Pumas I get cushy. Wait, I actually got two from Burlington's. This pair right here. And then a pair of Reeboks. I don't know what my obsession is with this hunter green color, but I think last year I picked up a pair of Pumas that was the exact same color, but these are Reeboks. And when I tell you, 
comfortable as fuck. I'm an old head, so you know your girl keep a pair of classics. I actually got two. The all black soldier pair, if you know, you know. And then I have a Easter colored pair. They white with like the little Easter colors on them. I bought those last year. They white, so I may have only worn them probably once or twice. But they is coming out this summer. Like, even if it's just for me to wear them to the gym, they coming out. But I had to get these. As soon as I saw them, I went hunting for them in my size. These were cute. And they do what they need to do when I'm at the gym. Like, they comfortable as hell. I wear these. I've been wearing them. Between these and the other ones, yeah. That's what I've been wearing to the gym. Because a lot of my workout clothes either have bright colors in them, like the Pumas. Or, like, some Army Fatigue. Kind of like the pair that I got on now. They have this Hunter Green in them. And I wear them with these. So, those are the pair of shoes that I bought out of there. And the stuff that I got out of Burlington. I actually have one more thing, and this was for my daughter. I haven't even given it to her yet, but my daughter has always been obsessed with Mickey and Minnie Mouse. Um, Ever since <laughs> the first birthday, she was allowed to pick her own stuff she wanted for her birthday. Like... So I just had to get her this. And it's a little Mickey Mouse, Minnie Mouse wallet with her, cause she is about to turn 13 this summer. She can put her driver's license in here. She does, not driver's license, <laughs> baby, I ain't ready for that. Um, She can put her state ID in it as well as her bank card. <laughs> you gotta set your kids up for success, so. This will be hers for her to carry um, in her purse. And like I said, let me keep putting this stuff back in these bags so we can keep going on in order. Um, the next stop is actually Ross, but I only bought one thing from there. Nope, I'm lying. I bought two things. First thing, hyaluronic acid. I now go looking for this anytime I go into Ross, Burlington, TJ Maxx, any of them stores. I go looking for that everywhere. Um, and the other thing was another pair of shoes that I bought. Um, Puma Preform Lights. Oh, Proform Foam Lights. I'm sorry. And these are the color right here for the ones that I bought. Another shoe that I've been wearing to the gym or to work and it's really comfortable. Since I wasn't able to show y'all my daughter hair, she just walked into the room. She kind of shy to get on camera, but let me see if I can get her to come in here. She trying to hide behind the wall and go in the bathroom. Come call you so they can see your hair. As long as I'm not an eye view, oh, Okay, well then turn backwards. She don't want her face to be shown on camera. But this is what I'm talking about. Baby, my daughter has a head full of hair. She not really fond of those grown girl hairstyles. So don't come for me in my comments talking about she got her hair done like a child. My daughter likes wearing her hair like this other than when I braid her hair up. But like I said, it is a all day chore. Y'all see all this hair, and we really about ready for a trim. Um, but I told her for her birthday, I'm gonna allow her to dye the back portion of her hair green, which is part of what I'm gonna show you in the next part of everything that I bought. But thank you, Kaya, for coming and letting them see your hair. Um, so let's move on to the next bag. Um, this is actually going to be stuff I bought for the gym from Bell's Outlet. Number one, knee sleeves. Um, I have arthritis in both of my knees. And I am trying to get the strength up on my legs. So, 
I need these. Your, your girl need these. And for only $7.99, I had to buy them. I'm removing them from the pack so y'all can see them. The size that I got was a 2X because your girl legs is kind of thick. So these are the knee sleeves. I know they not them real thick ass ones that you see people wearing in the gym, but I got to start somewhere. And since these I could get quick, fast and walk in the store, I'm going to start off here. And if I feel that I need something thicker than these, I'll move up to the next pair. And the brand that makes these are Archstone Active. They are nylon mixed with latex. Now, I'm allergic to latex, so these will always have to be on top of some workout pants. So anytime I do legs, I'm gonna have to have on pants. It's either that, or I'm gonna have to put on or take some Benadryl, cause I can't do goddamn latex. Let me see how much latex is in here. Okay, so the way your girl ripped this up. Okay, it actually does not say how much. So, I've already taken Benadryl because of something I took earlier. So, I should be okay with these. I actually also bought some knee wraps. It says the one size fit all by Armand. Armani Hardwick Fitness and these are knee wraps for um, you for knee support these right here were only $3.99 you know your girl is for the low ski woe ski anything I can get a deal on I'm with it I need a box cutter to open these oh never mind your girl got a pair of scissors And let's see what these look like. See, when I bought these, I was scared that it was only going to be one because it doesn't say on the packaging whether it was going to be two. And it is only one. So I should have known that from the price being $3.99. But you know, your hopes always be high. And this is a knee wrap and it's Velcro. So, however you finish off wrapping, you should end off right here. Hold on. Okay, so that was the knee strap I bought right here. Let me wrap this back up and put this back in its box. Because these going to the gym with me tonight. And since my knee is worse on my right side, I might put this on on the right side and then put that knee sleeve on top of it and see how that works. Um, what I also bought, oh, don't even have to do that. Well, I actually bought two of them. Didn't even realize it. That show you, this wasn't no shopping I did in the past couple of days. This was probably last week, probably a week a week and a half and I've been sitting on making this video um I also needed a pair of gloves for when I do upper body I'm not yet that advanced to where I need straps or grips um for it but some regular gloves for me will do me just fine and since I've lost so many pair these was only $3.99 from TKO and these are a size large because that does make a difference. And I'm going to show you what they look like on my hand. And they do have a little bit of stretch to them. But as you can see, $3.99. I couldn't beat that, especially when this is what I was looking for. I didn't want no hand straps or none of that other stuff. All these max weightlifters be using. I didn't want that. So, 
$3.99 for those. $3.99 for the wraps. And then $7.99 was for the sleeves. So, you know, to do your workouts, like, you don't have to go spending a whole bunch of money. Like, I literally made me almost a personalized gym in my house. I have resistant bands where I can do upper body. Um, I have some stuff set up on my door where I can also do upper body, lower body as well. I have dumbbell sets that I've purchased from either Marshalls or Ross. I haven't really purchased anything like that from um, Burlington's yet. Because every time I go in there, it's a hit or a miss when it comes to stuff like that. But you can get your beginner stuff. Or for if you don't have time to go to the gym. Or you don't want to pay that gym membership. Like a lot of these workouts you can do with resistant bands. Five Below, Walmart, um, TJ Maxx, Marshalls. They always have resistant band sets. I have a ton of them. I've even purchased jump rope sets from them. Um, I have a regular jump rope, and then I also have a weighted jump rope. And like I said, the different resistant bands with the grip on them, you can purchase all of that stuff from out of all of those stores I just named for the low. Like, I think out of everything that I purchased, the most that I spent was like 39 and that's for... I'll show you because it's in my bathroom. That was for this dumbbell set that can also, not dumbbell, the, um, damn, it won't even come to mind right now. But this is how I use it this way or to do rolls this way. Or you can take this apart and you have a dumbbell set and I have the additional weights that came with it. So $39.99 I think is what I spent on this. So it don't take a lot to get some work done. You can start from anywhere. Let me sit this here. You can start from anywhere and probably the most you'll spend is like 40 bucks on something. But now we on to my favorite part because I love doing hair even though I have carpal tunnel. I love to braid and I also love to dye hair. So we didn't until this store opened up have a big a big beauty supply store. Let me just say it like that. I know in other states you got like a whole damn warehouse where you could go and purchase beauty supply products. We have like little, I don't even know what to say the size of it is other than little. Little hair stores and then we got a one that's a little bit bigger, but my favorite hair store and it's almost an hour away from me on the west side of Orlando because I stay on the east side. But I will drive there with no problem and don't even better eye to get them so we're gonna go through it and the name of the beauty supply store is beauty masters and it's in orlando so first things first like i told y'all i'm allowing her to dye her hair or i'm gonna dye it but i'm allowing her to have dyed hair this is first thing bleach Let's go through. There's a couple bags inside bags. So you can see everything. Because your girl went stupid in there. And then I just found another Dollar Tree bag. But we'll get to that. So when I went there, I spent $128. The only time I'm a little slight. So we have the dye, I'm sorry, not the dye, the bleach, 10 volume developer from the same company. 
I don't believe in when I'm using products like that when it comes to mixing, especially like bleach and then the dye. I mean, and the developer, I get the shit that go together. Shampoo, I do the same. Shampoo, conditioner from the same line. You feel me? Unless my hair told me already that I need to do something different, it's going to come from the same line. You feel me? And we got another guest appearance from my niece hiding in the corner. Then... So this is the color that she chose for her hair. Kiss Temptations Emerald. So I got her a couple of bottles of that. I really only got two. Because I'm hoping two will cover that nice under. Normally where people get an undercut from. I'm hoping two bottles will cover that. Now, I do plan on doing mine because my lock anniversary is coming up March 28th. Put your girl at five years. I want me a nice spicy brown color. So I actually got um, paprika. And because as you guys have seen in multiple videos and can probably see with me turning my head, I got a lot of damn hair. So I have a couple of bottles of that so I can dye my hair. I got a big detangling brush by Diane for my daughter's hair. I always pick up edge brushes, put those there. She asked for a snack when we was in the store didn't even eat it that is where I always go to get my good bonnets I purchased like seven bonnets because one two three four five six okay six bonnets but here is three of them one of them my daughter has on her dresser. Plus, we both had opened one um, when we got them home. I also purchased a Beauty Treats um, banana setting powder. Gonna try that and see how that works. Again, my niece. The shades that I was wearing that day. The 213 Originals. <laughs> you feel me? And like I told y'all before, they lash approved. Blanking and everything with the lashes on. So y'all never forget to go check out 213. You feel me? And then I always get lip products. Like, I'm a lip product whore. So I'm always going to get that. I also purchased... Uh, edge grow gel um it's premium cbd and 24 karat gold it's made by touchdown 5.1 ounces this was 7.99 but look at it though i am one of those girls who purchase certain things based off of how it look so this was a purchase off of based on how it looks this is um, made by RA Cosmetics. It's a lemongrass, lemongrass and 100% pure shea butter. The scent, I'm sorry, is lemongrass. And baby, when I tell you, this thing just smells so good. And it's nice and whipped. This I remember this price because when he went to ring it up, he couldn't, and they had to go hunting to find it. I had to go show him where it was at. Four ninety nine. Pure shea butter, one hundred percent pure shea butter, whipped, and the scent is lemongrass. I bought two of those. This is the one I haven't opened yet. The other one I have 
in my bathroom and I put that on right after I get out the shower. Now we finna move on to the lip products. Some of them I got for my mom. Cause my mom likes a natural lip color, like a brown or a brownish gold. But me, I'm with the shenanigans. So here's one, that plum color that I told y'all about in one of my previous videos. Pretty much, I think it was the last haul I did. We gonna try these on. No. Tell her she gonna have to wait. She trying to get stuff and I don't know, I already got stuff organized. Y'all hold a little tight cause I'm almost done with the video. Cause you know, when it comes to my daughter, I'm gonna cut y'all short. Um, but this one is a dark burgundy ishy brown color. We gonna try this one out and this one's a matte. That nice vampy color. I'm having to move my niece out the way because she's still trying to get that iPad. Do y'all see that color though? Do y'all see that color? When I told y'all that color that that one auntie had, guest appearance. You feel me? But this is it. And I'm about to have to take it off because it's drying down real fast. Yeah, that dried down fast. So if you're looking for a quick mat. Oh, yeah, it dried fast. Okay, here is, I think this one's a gloss. Yeah. Kiss Me Lip Filler Lip Injection Injected Du Jour. This one is pretty much made by Sisters. And the color is Sereno. And it's a nice goldish color brown. This one, I bought two of them because one I got for me and one I got for my mom because this is the color that she likes. This is going to help me get that mat off. So if y'all see me putting on a little extra, that's why. And you get that instant tingling from that peppermint. So I'm going to take this off and show y'all what it looked like for real. Because y'all can still see that last lipstick underneath it. But you do get that tingling. And like I said, gloss going to always get down, get off a of mat. Every time. If you didn't know, now you know. See what I was saying? Like a perfect new looking gloss. And it has a little bit of the shimmer in it. But you do get that lip injection. Sorry. For me trying to take off them other ones. But this is what it looks like. And you get that peppermint burning tingling sensation yeah it's doing that but what y'all think of the color yeah i like that once you can get past that tingle yeah and then you see how it's shining though yeah and i got one more and this one's a gloss as well. But this one's a blue. Okay, this one, gonna have to go old school. 
and these always have security tags on it this brand and normally this brand when you see them in the hair store because they know motherfuckers be in there stealing them excuse my language but they make it hard for people like me like don't get me wrong i'm gonna pay for it but why i gotta go through this just to get into it Like, I legit got to go through some hard down security packaging. Okay, I just pulled it all the way up to the lid. I'm going to leave it there. And this is a high shine. This one's actually made by the same brand, so maybe that's why. It's a high shine HD lip color. Do y'all see that color? I'm a sucker for some blue lipstick or blue lip gloss. Now, this has a scent to it. It smells kind of blueberry-ish. But do y'all see that color, though? I, this colors like this be right up my alley and don't come for me because I know my face ashy I'm leaving this on the rest of the video and then I have a I was surprised to see them have this in the store because normally the only place I can find these at is at Walmart but they had that hard candy and I love hard candy lip glosses. I think I showed y'all in my last video. I have a shit ton of them. This one is a nude color. And this is what it looks like. Like, it's a legit nude. You can barely even see that shit on my skin. Put on that nice liner, deep chocolate liner, and put this in the middle. It's going to do it every time. Every time. So when I saw this, I had to buy it. Like, I'm a real deal lip gloss whore. Here is another one that I just bought. Don't mind the red at the bottom. That's because a pen broke in my bag. But I love nude. A nice brown lip gloss. And then you put that one on top of it. Like, come on. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. Come on, baby. Don't play with it. <laughs> now, time. It's the one and not the two. You feel me? And then they got shimmer in it. So, come on. Let's go to the other ones that I purchased. Because I always have to go to the west side for hair stuff. So, I always go and check out the other hair stores while I'm on that side. Here is another high key tropical instant edge control. It says that it has a maximum hold with no flaking. See, this is what I like to see. Do you see that? Security. So I can tell if somebody done opened this. Okay. It's not thick though. But yeah, it do, ooh. It do have that tropical scent. It says it's a quick drying formula with no flaking. Now, let, let's do this. We gonna test it out, you feel me? Now y'all know I'm still free forming, so I don't have no retwists. Locks just locking off the top of my head. You feel me? So we gonna put a little bit right here. You know, try this right here on the camera. You feel me? Now, I don't do my edges often. 
But come on. It's gonna be that one one occasion where I need to. So I might as well get what I need to do it. You feel me? I do have that real curly wavy texture hair as y'all can see from this baby lock that's coming in right here now when i put edge control on i use the brush i put the brush in it get a little bit of product on it like that now i'm not good at edges which is why i don't do them often But that smell though, I love that smell, that island smell. And I see I'm also a person who don't like a lot of product in her hair. Cause yes, you can detox your locks, but is it fun to do? No. Now this is the tropical right here. This how y'all know I'm real, real, for real, for real. Because I'm actually doing this with y'all on camera. And I don't even... This just came to me in the middle of me doing this video. But let's go ahead and try the other one. I'll try it right underneath this one. And since I purchased two edge brushes, might as well use both of them. You feel me? Okay, edge brush coming through so I ain't got to... Almost ripped my nails to use it. Let's see if they just as secure as um the other one was. Make sure it got that little sealant on it, which you might not even need because they completely wrapped the whole container in plastic wrap. But let's see. Now I told y'all this was the CBD and 24 karat gold. Okay, it don't have that plastic covering over it, but look at how it look. I don't know if y'all, if the flakes is showing on camera, but look at that. That's just too pretty. So let's try it. Oh, I lied. It do have plastic on it. <laughs> they gotcha, girl. But this is what it looks like. I can't quite put my hand on that scent, but it does not smell bad. Again, we gonna do it like the last one. Now this one a little bit thicker. So maybe that's saying it's gonna do a little bit more. Now we gonna do it right underneath. Now, like I said, this one is a little bit thicker. And I told y'all again, I am not really good at doing edges. I should have went on ahead and enlisted my sister to come in here and do them for me real quick so y'all can see. The bottom one is that 24 karat gold. And the one on top. Now, I'm not even going to lie to y'all. This one is softer. But you can feel once you go back in it with the brush. Because I didn't take any of the product off. Now, I don't know if it needs to set or anything like that. But this, you can easily move it. This 24 karat. You ain't just moving that sister girl around like that. Now, y'all see what it's hitting for. Like I told y'all, I don't really do edges. And to be honest, what I just swooped up right there was another baby lock in the making. So, But y'all see what it looked like. Tropical CBD 24 karat gold. I don't know if y'all will be able to find them in y'all hair stores. But we got them in mind. 
and I had to try them. Like, even if I don't wear them all the time. Now, what I also picked, because I envy, other than Ayani, to me, they make some of the best lashes. Because, like I told y'all in the other video, like the ones from Kiss, Kiss is number three on the list. They make lashes that don't really have no band. Do y'all see that? So it'll go onto your eye seamlessly. And these, $3.99. I bought two pair, cause more than likely I'm gonna stack them. Invisible Band Remy 3Ds, and it's the Eye Envy. 100% human hair, naturally fluffy. Like, come on. I had to get them. And that's pretty much everything I bought from the hair stores. And I am gonna put these back in the bag. And the last bag is, oh wait, I didn't even show y'all the glosses I got. Not every brown girl or anybody who go into a hair store know about these glosses. The, oh Jesus, the Broadway glosses. This one is a um, shea butter gloss. And this one right here is a gold lip gloss. It has argon oil, jojoba oil. I know I'm probably saying that wrong. Rose tip and mint oil. And it's a rose gold made by that same brand. And like I said, the other one was shea butter. This one I got for my daughter. And then I also purchased another one, a rose ship, a rose hip oil. So I'm I said it wrong when I said it on the last one. A rose hip oil. It says it reduces fine lines on lips, moisturizes and heals, and also contains vitamin A. And these were only $1.99. All three of them. But like I said, security. Because they know people steal. This one, all hair stores on my side of town sell Nicks. So if you can't go into Ross, Target, uh, Ulta, um, Sephora, which I don't shop in. That's another store for another time. You can always find it in, in the hair store. Even in Sally's. But that one is another one that I got. So that concludes all the stuff from the hair store. My favorite place in the world other than the Dollar Tree, you feel me? Because majority of the time, all I go get is lip glosses, hair color, and I, uh, I guess, edge control. See, that bottom one ain't moving. This one, if you like edges that ain't stiff, that tropical one will work for you. That 24K in CBD ain't really budging, but the real test for anybody gym girlies or guys is how that thing hold up when you start sweating and you be in the gym. You feel me? Because everybody want to go to the gym looking cute. And then you end up walking out of the gym and have to walk out with a hair wrap on your head because you have been sweating like crazy. Now this is one last bag that I did find. Um, which was the reason why I went to the Dollar Tree that trip was because of this Tinted Rose Oil Lip Balm. The girl on TikTok said it'll give you the perfect shade that you should have on your lips. So I bought one for me and one for my mom. Was gonna keep this blue on throughout the whole video, but we not, cause we wanna see what it's gonna come out like. See, that's what I love about gloss. You see how that just come right off. Now, this is what the packaging looks like. 
tinted rose oil lip balm. Let's get this open. Now, another thing I'm finna go looking for um, in the Dollar Tree, because I think it was Thrifty Tiffany from off of YouTube. Y'all go check out her channel. I think it was Thrifty Tiffany that showed it on there. And it's these stainless steel straws. This one didn't come from the Dollar Tree, but I'm pretty sure, because I think I'm pretty positive that she found some in her local Dollar Tree. Now, she is in Atlanta, and I'm in Florida. But I'm just saying, why not? Might as well go looking for it. Now, it's kind of like a lipstick. But we finna try it on. It doesn't really have a scent to me. Oh. Y'all see. Y'all see what my lips look like before I put this on. And when I tell you this is smooth like butter. Smooth like butter. I'm going to have to go find me some more of these. It says, so what's your shade? And I think I am the middle shade these are the three shades that it says that your lips will come out to the middle shade i don't think i'm that much the last shade but it could be but look at that now y'all see it's clear no color to it No color to it whatsoever. And you get a nice amount in there for a dollar twenty-five. Come on. Don't play with Dollar Tree. They not one of them. But y'all see, that's clear. Y'all see what color it is on my lips though. So these are the three shades that they say you can come out to be. It says um swipe the bomb starting at the center of your lips and work outward reapply as needed come on here look at that yeah i'm most definitely going out there and getting some more now y'all seen this in my video i don't know how many of y'all near me but don't don't go in the store buying them all up i promise i ain't gonna do these like i do the lashes but y'all don't go in there buying them up for everybody. Let let other folks get out there and try them too. Go on in there, get y'all about two, maybe three. If it's less than that on the shelf, just get one and circle around to another Dollar Tree. Because you know Dollar Trees be right around the corners from each other. This is another thing that I purchased. Lip scrubbers. Because I like matte lipstick. And those, hold on. Sorry, y'all. I like matte lipstick. And them things ain't easy to get off. So, I bought these. I know this is not y'all first time seeing these. And these are the eyelash um, cases. Or you can put your little eye on your lashes. You feel me? It can hold up to three pair. And you got a little mirror in there. Three pair of lashes and a mirror. That is dirty. Okay. But look at that. Three pair of lashes and a mirror. Yeah. Yeah. I had to. Seen it on Thrifty Tiffany video. Had to get it. Okay, so I guess I did find another one of those um, body butters. Sage and cedar scent. 
okay they have this plastic covering on it and i don't want to take it off but another one i'm going to try that i bought these for me and my mom's car it's your sunglass clips this was my first time seeing them in the dollar tree and this is the color rhinestone that i have on my steering wheel and my tag and my gear shaft so i figured why not and if you didn't know blue is my favorite color and then another facial serum by be pure um it has niacinamide in it i have been hearing a lot of the girls on tiktok and on youtube doing their skincare routines and they're always talking about niacinamide so i figured why not get them for a dollar 25 you feel me little capsules you just pop it and use it it says it helps dark spots appear less noticeable aids in moisturizing skin and it's easily applied to the skin you get 10 of them in here for a dollar 25 and then like i told y'all i have a few more of those so y'all i don't know if y'all like me and been a little bit down or just need a little retail therapy you know get in your local stores even drive out to the next city over do a little shopping and tell them taylor sent you splash by taylor sent you y'all don't forget to like comment subscribe and go check me out on all of my social media platforms y'all been splashed by taylor have a good day